So you had quite an enormous undertaking with this role. Uh, how did you approach taking him on in this particular genre? I, I don't know. I mean, when I first read the, the script, I really liked it and, and understood the character very clearly. You know, he's just this guy that feels trapped and, and wants to connect and feel alive. Um, he wants to get out there. And, and uh, yeah, I understood that and really cared about him. And then uh, just kind of spoke to Jonathan about it and watched some zombie films and studied around a little bit. And um, we, had a, we had a Cirque du Soleil trainer come in and me and Rob would kind of I don't know, practice zombie walking and running. <laughs> um, there's some good videos of that somewhere. And, um, and then just turn up on set and, and give it a go and, and just focus more about um, the other characters, what's going on around him, um, and not really worry about what I was doing a lot of the time, to be honest. What was most challenging for you? Ooh, most challenging? Uh, the zombie run was difficult. <laughs> you know, Teresa's a quick runner and, and trying to keep up, but in a zombie fashion. Uh, <laughs> My mates had a good laugh when they saw me doing that. Um, and, and not laughing, I had, I, had a, I had a big, there's a lot of outtakes. And it was always me as well, most of the time, really? just laughing. Yeah, the I lost DVD it a lot. Be great. Because a lot of the time, you know, you're, you're focusing on doing nothing or just being a zombie. <laughs> but then other people are doing funny stuff right around you and it's very <laughs> difficult not to, not, to, not to break. What was your experience working, uh, like working with this director? It was really, really fantastic. Jonathan's a, a really cool, Guy, and I was, a, I was a fan of his work anyway already. Um, but then to have him um, on set, he just creates a really great atmosphere to work on, and he's very enthusiastic and supportive. You know, you, fin you finish a take, and he'd, he'd be out and be like, "Yeah, it's awesome!" Ah, like the, I remember like one of the one of the first days doing a scene in the plane with um, Teresa. He came in and was just so encouraging, um, and 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 was like, "You can do this. You got it." That was amazing. Carry on. Let's do another. <laughs> and, and, that, and there's nothing better than that. Just a, a little bit of confidence when, particularly when you're doing a role like this, which isn't, you know, you could could end up with a lot of egg on your face. Right. Mm. Exactly. Um, well, you know, what do you think will surprise audiences the most? I think the I, I think the humour is, uh, is going to be an, a, a nice touch that people maybe weren't expecting when you hear the concept of the film and stuff. Um, just the fact that it doesn't take itself too seriously. It's light-hearted and, and, and fun, yeah. Right. Well, thank you so much. Thank I you thoroughly enjoyed it. I think it's going to surprise a lot of people. Good. And we look forward to having you on AMC Screens. Nice one. Hey, guys. If you like this video, make sure to stop what you're doing and subscribe to our AMC Theatres YouTube channel to keep up to date on all the movie news, editorials, and our AMC Movie Talk Show. Also, make sure to follow us on Facebook and Twitter to hear about all our special promotions, contests, and prize giveaways.